Essentially, the work is about trying to make a difference in a community that has suffered intergenerational disadvantage. We were thinking, well, where do we start and what community would we work with and who was the highest area of needs? And there was some early consultative work going on in the Balaby community. And from that work, we actually saw what it was like to be in that community in the summer holidays from a child's perspective. For me, that was very powerful. We had children who were drawing photos of cars on fire, of violence happening in community, of drug issues, and that really inspired us to focus on that community. We know we need to do long-term work to help shift intergenerational change. So we started with deep authentic engagement where there was not a lot of trust from members in the community. So that was challenging, but very interesting and really revealing about what was going on in that community. And it was great to hear from the community what their challenges and aspirations were because that hadn't really been heard before. And then based on that, we worked with the community and did a co-design and developed an action plan that that community themselves was engaged with and wanted to see happen. Really good. We've got so many people here today represented from all parts of the community, from our really young people to some of our elders in the community. And we all seem to be saying the same thing, which is great. So all the hard work that we've done in the background is really resonating with our local community members and it's great to see that we're all on the one page. Everyone's coming together and trying to think of ideas to engage with the younger community. I'm thinking of moving out, but I don't think I'll move out now. <laughs> My name's Ben. And I'm Zach. And we're here for the Collective 2518 Forum. The Balambi Action Plan Check-In Day. And today we're checking back in with all of you in detail on, on those actions, the, prior, the themes, the priorities and the actions. How exciting it can be when people come together and decide to work together on things to improve where they live. good thing with this is that we're actually saying no more. We're not waiting anymore. We're going to do it ourselves. I've seen how strong a community can be when they work together. There seems to be a real momentum and uh, I think uh, people are sort of feeling very positive. There's authentic collaboration, genuine partnerships, there's no hierarchy in decision making, community is listened to and the results that we have obtained by everyone working together has been absolutely outstanding. When you hear and speak to community about what they're saying about our place, it really sort of highlights why we do what we do. I'm really happy and excited for the future of Balambi and for the future for our children and our grandchildren. We've seen results within two years that we were not expecting and things are already changing in that community. So that's actually inspired the leadership group in the Illawarra Shoalhaven to start working in more communities. Everybody connects to the purpose of this work, all of us working together, and that's what makes this work different because no single individual or organisation can affect intergenerational change on their own. It's by us working together and empowering individuals and the community as a whole that can make a difference. Mm -hmm.